What's up you guys, Andrew Roboto here, and welcome back to Five Nights of Wario's 3 Custom Room Edition, where we will be taking on part one of the dark hallway in this video. And for the dark hallway, we have we can start the game, we have the extras, which we'll check out after we beat, beat the mode, like we did with the custom night mode. And for the dark hallway mode, we got... We have to survive in a dark hallway against strange and disturbing creatures. So, without further ado, we will take on part one of the dark hallway and see what it has to offer for us. Okay, so we have normal and hard mode, which I'm going to start off doing normal just to get the sense of it. Okay, so on to part one of the normal, of the dark hallway. Okay, we have a flashlight to use, and we have a charge, and we can charge it. Okay. Yeah, and I'm drinking Gatorade for this video because it, I was at the beach earlier and it was and it is a hot day today. Okay. So who are we going to be dealing with for this night? Is it going to be the same characters or are we going to be dealing with different characters? Okay, I just got to... I gotta check for these disturbing creatures with the flashlight. See, oh, God! okay, that was Bruno Gates. That just jump scared me. Okay, okay, so for Bruno Gates, I gotta flash the light at him, which I couldn't do in time. And then I don't know who else we're gonna be dealing with. God, I was about to flash the light at him and then he jump scared me because I couldn't even react in time because I wasn't paying attention to what was coming. Okay, so let's check. I gotta look all over this area because I know Bruno Gates is gonna come from this area right here. And then I don't know who else we're dealing with aside from Bruno Gates. And apparently Bruno Gates is a virus in this hallway. So I'm assuming all the characters that we're dealing with are going to be viruses. Which viruses are kind of creepy, I'm not going to lie. Especially if they're animatronics. <laughs> okay, we got to look for, for Bruno Gates and who else and whoever else we're dealing with. Yeah, because apparently you only have a certain amount of time to react, so you got to be quick in this scan. Especially because you're in a dark hallway and only have a flashlight to defend yourself with. Oh, by Steve Bowser. Do I have to look away from him? Okay, good. Okay, so for Bowser, we have to look away from him. For Bruno Gates, we have to flash the light at him. And is there anybody else we're going to be dealing with? Ah! Oh, I just, I just stopped Toad. Ah, come on, Bruno Gates. You couldn't let me charge my flashlight? Ugh, please. God, I'm already struggling here, and it's only the beginning of the video. Because I was just charging the lights, and then I got jump scared by Bruno Gates again. God, can you let me charge the lights, please, Bruno Gates? <sighs> no wonder why you're a murderer, because you're quick. And that's actually true, Bruno Gates is the one who murdered Wario in the game. So that's why I'm calling him a murderer. Okay, I, at, least, at least I know how to deal with Toad. For Toad, we have to, we have to flash the lights at him, too. Because he run only difference is he runs just like he does in Final Fantasy Warriors 2 and in the other games. Okay, so for Toad and Bruno Gates, we have to flash the light at them. For Bowser, we have to look away from him. Oh, here's Bowser speaking the devil. We gotta look away from him. Okay. Bowser comes on this side. Whoa! Oh. Okay, I just had to deal with Toad real quickly. 
Cause whoa, Bruno Gates. Okay, good. I got Bruno Gates just in time. Now I'm gonna go charge up the light because this thing wastes like half the power. Okay, good thing I was able to react to Bruno Gates in time. Alright, I have a strategy for Bruno Gates. If I use up the light, I'm gonna check for him, charge the light while checking for him at the same time. Okay. Because I already got killed by Bruno Gates twice in this video. Because I couldn't react in time. Oh, and there's Bowser. I can see his long arms. Okay. And I'm told you have the least amount of time to react to because he runs. Ah! Okay. Okay, I just had to deal with Toad. Phew. God, Toad is really stressful to deal with. Because of how fast he is. And you have very little time to react to him. But for Bruno Gates and Bowser, they're easier to react to. And speaking of, I'm going to check for Bruno Gates because I know he comes after Toad. And I don't want to get jump scared by him like I did earlier in the video. Because Bruno Gates is stupid. Oh, here's Bruno Gates. I got him. Now I'm going to recharge the flashlight. There you go. Flashlight is recharged. It's 5 a.m. We're doing well so far. Thankfully, because this, this, this first part of the dark hallway mode is pretty stressful. With Toad running and and Demon Wario and Bowser coming out of nowhere. Okay, so let's just... I gotta check for them. You survived the dark hallway. You survived the dark hallway, but don't think you're truly safe. Press space to end. Okay, what happens next? Oh. Oh, okay, the dark hallway is just one... It's just one part. Okay, it's just one level. Oh, interesting. Okay, so I... Let me see. I'm assuming we just do that one night and that's it. Okay. And we have the extra content, which I'm going to check out right now. Okay, we have Virus Bruno Gate... Virus Bowser and Virus Toad. And Virus Bruno Gate is the only one I've been jump scared by. I haven't been jump scared. I was never jump scared by Bowser or Toad. Okay, let's take a look at the jump scare. Oh my god. Okay, so the jump scares are the same as with Wario and the gang in the main game. And the only character that has a different jump scare is Demon Wario. He has like a, let me think, what's the jump scare? Um, he has the same jump scare as he does in Final Fantasy Warriors 4. Okay, let's see. Let's check out the credits. And that's all we have. Okay, so. Alright, so I just decided, I just wanted to check out the extra, extra content. And I was actually wrong. There's actually two parts in the Dark Hallway mode. We have Normal Mode and Hard Mode. Which we've beaten normal mode. Now we're going to take on hard mode. So without further ado. Oh wait. So. And the other thing I was wrong about is that. Um, Dark hallway actually has two levels. We have only two levels. We have normal mode and hard mode. So we beat normal mode. Now we're going to do hard mode. So without further ado. We will take on hard mode. As well in this video. Since I have enough time left. And see what that's not for us. It's going to be harder, though, so i got to react really quickly for this night. And the level. Okay, so... Let's see who's coming. I mean, at least we only have to deal with three viruses and not, like, five or six of them, like, in the main game. Ah! Okay. Oh, phew. I just had to stop Toad real quickly. Ah! Bowser! Okay. Okay, I got rid of I got rid of Bruno Gates and I got rid of Bowser and Toad. Okay, so they're going to be triple teaming me this night because it's because it's we're doing the hard mode. We're not doing like normal mode, 
Normal mode, they don't double team or triple team me because it's easier. Hard mode as well, just hard, so they're going to triple team me this night. And I'm hoping I don't die as much as I did in normal mode, because in normal mode I died twice try when I did this video earlier, but I beat it on the third time. Oh, here's Bowser. Look away. Ah! Toad! Okay. God, I just had to deal with both Bowser and Toad. Let me go check for Bruno Gates. And I briefly recharge the lights because I need to be be, al be on alert for Bruno Gate and the others. Okay. Alright, so this is definitely... Hard mode is definitely more stressful than normal mode is. Because hard mode is, well, just, just hard. Just plain hard. Ah, Toad! Okay, good. Got rid of Toad. I haven't seen Bruno Gate yet, so that's a good thing. I've only seen... Toad and Bowser just recently. Bruno Gate I only saw like in the beginning of the, the mode. Ugh. Okay, we need to look for him. Okay. Ah, Toad! Ugh, okay. Ah, phew. I reacted to him just in time. He's so hard to react to because of how fast he is. Ah, Bruno Gate! Okay, I got rid of Bruno Gate. Now I gotta go check for Bowser, and I'm gonna charge the light while I'm at it. Because I just dealt with Bruno Gate and Toad. Okay, phew. Alright, this is definitely stressful, definitely. Toad! Okay, got rid of Toad. God, you are a wild animal, Toad. Let me charge up the light real quickly, check for Bruno Gate and Bowser. Because Bowser comes from the right side, Bruno Gate comes from the left side, and then Toad comes from the middle. Ah, Toad! Charge up the light real quickly, check for Bruno Gate. And we've beaten hard mode. Alright, phew. You survived Dark Hallway, but don't think you're just truly safe. Good job on beating hard mode. Have the cheering Wario head. This head is now on your menu. Oh, thank you, for Wario, for cheering for me. Even though Wario is an amateur character who wants to kill me, he's he's proud of me for beating hard mode, so that's good. And I was glad I was able to beat hard mode on the first try. I thought it would take me a few tries to beat like with normal mode, but I beat it, so that's a good thing. Alright. And we have the cheering Wario head right here that we just unlocked, so that's pretty cool. Alright, and before I end this video, I have one more thing I want to show you. Um... There's actually a cheat I haven't activated yet, which is Strange Noise, and if you press the one, one to activate, it will make the sound. And then I also haven't used Night Skip yet, because I haven't had to use it, because none of the rooms have been stressful. The only, the only cheat I used was Instant Recharge for some nights. Okay, so like I said before I end the video, I'm going to play the Strange Noise, since there is kind of a toy, an Easter egg. I'll just leave all the characters on level zero since I'm just playing the noise. And I'm going to do it in the pantry. Alright, and before I, before I play the noise, I'm going to mute the phone call first since there is a phone call, obviously. Hey, uh, Mike couldn't make it, so Jack is going to be here for tonight's call. Uh, good over reliable Jack, am I right? Okay, I'm gonna mute the phone call, and now I'm gonna play the noise, press 1 to activate. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> okay, it just plays, it just plays the sound of Wario screaming and crashing into something. That's really cool. But anyways, um... I will end my video here. There you have it. That is Five Nights of Warriors 3 Custom Room Edition for you all. Um, I will end my video here. Like I said, thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.